is this? Learn vacation during this time. Go. No matter what I search, I can't find anything related. Natalie burned a teddy bear or onesie, so I have no fucking idea what you could even be referencing to. Yeah, no clue. Okay. He was just making a joke. And just make leave this here. And yeah, we'll there is no. my music <laughs> yeah there is no fucking way with the views jake gets he's making his his living from that so <laughs> why is he coping about this why is he coping about the subscribers <laughs> no one was in his chat and he was coping about this this is incredible iron gullet the tighter the closer these get to 10 minute tight cuts the better for, for the purposes of this, but this is starting, like, you're really starting to dial it in, man. I mean, I'm, I'm, I can feel that I feel, there's something here. This is, this is a great way to digest, Dave. I'll give you every view every time. I'll give you a view every time. We'll work more. one at the time. <laughs> oh, Jake is a sh champagne socialist. The house he lives in is either paid for by his parents, lives with his parents... <laughs> If if he if he truly does nothing but twi Twitter or Twitch or Twitch? Twinkle Toes or whatever the fuck, mm -hmm. yes, I am. A There's streamer. no way he makes enough money not from the views he's getting. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> uh, it, how many people are even unsubscribed in this chat? Like everyone's subscribed. That's just I mean that's just how it works, man. I don't know. I'm very lucky, dude. I bought this house with YouTube money, actually, not uh, Twitch money. I streamed after I moved here. Um, <clears throat> he's so bitter. Yeah, I don't know. He's just mad. I'm sorry I've had success, I guess. Go. Cool. Uh, hey, Dave, this one stream has more viewers than your videos get views in weeks of Sundays. Uh, 18 views. Yeah, we have 159 viewers right now, which isn't even like... You know, if I if I responsibly streamed earlier in the day, we'd have uh, closer to 200. I mean, the earlier I stream, the more viewers I have. Go. But you know, uh, he gets he gets more of us. He might get more subbies if he can keep his consciousness for an entire stream. I don't know why he's mad about it. I appreciate you guys subscribing and stuff. I appreciate it. Uh, it's fun. Um, and now that I know it makes him mad, I mean, you know, uh, subscribe immediately. Oh, yeah, he either lives with his parents, lives in a rich uncle's house. That I don't. He doesn't care. I, bought, I, bought, I bought this house. I got a 15-year mortgage. I got real lucky before I got there, before the housing market snapped. I have an affordable mortgage. It's in a good part of town. I uh, think about putting a deck in the back. Uh, I've been talking about that. Just bought a new toilet. Going to do a basketball court. Probably last edition. It's going to be pretty pricey, but, you know. Go. Cool. Uh, but if you're a stream earlier, I won't be able to come to stream anymore. Well, I mean, I would still stream until now. Uh, how dare you own a nice house? It's not even that nice! All socialists and leftists must live on the street with potatoes. It's not even that nice of a house! Like, we put a lot of work into this shit. This thing was built in the fucking 40s, man. It has a coal chute. <laughs> it's made of bricks! It's a brick house. Uh, which is rare in the United States. Uh, I live in a very nice cardboard box. Uh, yeah, man. I have a basement and a backyard and stuff. I built a fence the first year we were here. Uh, yeah, we're just, I'm a homeowner. Yeah. Care about. Or uh, my, something. I wish my dad would have paid for it. He didn't give me shit, though. Sometimes his ghost comes in here and gives me some subscriptions, but he can't buy my love. He wouldn't. That looks good. Doing some puff pastry, beef, broccoli shit? Oh, yeah. Be or beef. Is that broccolini? Yeah. It's broccolini. That looks good as fuck. Is that mushrooms in there, too? Hell, yeah. I think I'm the first man that's ever yelled at Sarah. What the fuck? What? That was whiplash. I, I appreciate this edit. I think I'm the first man that's ever yelled at Sarah. What the fuck? Wait, was this after the debate? Was that what he was coping about? That's weird. Uh, no, you're not. Um. I hope you really have a ghost dad. Day. There you are. You were summoned. Give one to Fabuli. It won't work. It won't work. You didn't do enough in life. Yeah, this is yesterday. It gets worse. Great. She was so intent on having me talk to her. Mm-hmm. You think I'm like the first guy that's ever just told her? 
you know, fuck off? Uh, I mean, I've told her to fuck off. <laughs> oh, we we've had I've I've told her to fuck off before. <laughs> She's told me to fuck off too. I mean, you know, we've been together for six years. I mean, with the with the large amount of simps we have running around here, I wouldn't. Be yeah, I mean, not not Dave. Dave's not a simp. Dave, you want to fuck my wife so bad. I get it. I did last night. And the night before. And I might tonight as well. She's been so good. Shocked. Yeah. Well, and you can pretty much use any cheese of your choice. Just make sure. No, as far as I know, Jake has not uploaded his pizza video. He hasn't uploaded shit. What do you mean? Pizza video is uploaded. Pizza video. Is it up here still? No. Here, I'll show you. There's my steak. Uh, pink. Would you look at that? Beep. Strawberry Dude. lemonade and pizza. What? He's got pizza dough right there. Bit, look yeah, at him with his knuckles, knuckles doing pizza. And then he takes it out and it looks good. You can't even avoid it. Look at that. If you're watching this right now, I mean, would you look at that for two seconds? I mean, come on, boy. Anyway, um, I make pizza. And you can look at it. There's my steak. You can't look at that, though. That's just a picture, not a moving picture. I mean, I'll check real quick. <clears throat> yeah, he he wouldn't watch the one on Twitch, so uh, Sarah uploaded it to YouTube. Did he delete it, or did you did it get reported? Dude, he is so slow. I need to skip the. Okay, okay, Take okay, the time right. right now on a state fair. Just remember. Just remember. Dear detractors of mine. Jake has never once. Why is he still talking about me? <laughs> I'm not even on screen. <laughs> Ever. Overcooked me. Overcooked. Yeah. Oh, I know what you people are trying to goad me into. I would never overcook anything. That's true. Just keep in mind, your hero's never beaten me. <laughs> uh... Your hero's never beaten me. <laughs> I'm normal. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm I'm totally fine. <laughs> I'm fine. It's fine. Okay, we have like spicy relish here. Okay, fine. Did he forget? It's like Maxos. Oh my god, I'm gonna kill these fucking headphones. What's wrong with your headphones? Yeah, and, and great. Now, now it's cut out. You just, did he just growl? Is that a, is that like a man growl? Man, I'm a little boy, dude. <laughs> Trust me, I know my fucking audio's cutting out. <laughs> because if you remember, I didn't. <laughs> He's such a fucking. Emotional little boy. <laughs> He's so funny. I didn't ask her for any of that shit. Who's he talking about? Is he okay. talking about Sarah again? God damn it. Fucking sucking cunt. Cock sucking cunt. Yeah, man. Because if you remember, I didn't ask her for any of that. She pestered me yesterday. 
Yeah, you got dumpster. I had bro. no intention of coming after her. I didn't beg her for a conversation. Three, you know. <laughs> It was the other way around. Because <laughs> remember, those of you that were here yesterday, she came onto my my channel. You were talking about her sexually, and so she dumpstered you. I didn't go onto hers. I didn't egg <laughs> her on. I didn't mention her name. You did literally call her by her name and sexually harass her. Hello? Yeah, well, yeah. I'm sorry she got sexually excited for, you know, dealing with the first real man that would disagree with her. Oh! <laughs> Ew! Ew! What the fuck? We gotta get over here to the flat top grill. Bro, I can't believe! Every man who is in a beta soy boy bitch likes him younger. Excuse me, that was jarring. Pretty much every man who is in a beta soy boy bitch likes him younger. Go. I'm glad that children would be naturally repulsed by you. Uh, last Dave's stream I sat through, he unprompted mentioned Jake 15 times and Sarah 12 times. You counted? Amazing. The fact that he's still, uh, seething about this? <laughs> Four, no, no. It has to uh, Gnome Pickles, if you're, if you're counting, you wouldn't want to, like, do a super cut of that kind of shit, would you? That'd be amazing. With the timestamp in the, in the shot. <laughs> be incredible. Uh, I don't want to watch Dave's fan fiction about him and Sarah. Yeah, I mean, well, cool. yeah, he's weird, man. How's your ideal party going, Dave? <laughs> How old is your ideal party again, Dave? Oh, no. We call Bertha. Yeah, some men are. I recommend against it, but hey, you do you. Because older women typically come with a ton of baggage. Baggage. You, he means life experience? <laughs> life experience, obviously. And if you'd like your house nice and peaceful, you typically want to date younger. Dave, how's your home life with your partner? Is it going well? Are you very happy with your spouse? And your kids? And your successful life? And again, like I said, Taylor Swift would still have every bit of attention from every fucking I only fly private millionaire because she's a fucking 10. Oh, uh, Taylor Swift is a 10. He called girls sweet 16 bachelor party. I mean, I'm actually, you know, I mean, I'm glad that you're attracted to Taylor Swift, an adult. Uh, he really does like Taylor. Holy shit! Um, that is a that's a that's high praise uh, for Taylor Swift. And all she would have had to do was not be a singing sensation. She could have been a fucking barista at Starbucks. Wouldn't have mattered. Uh huh. Again, women, at least in their youth. Play life on goddamn story mode. Yes, bur <laughs> Cool. Life on story mode. Uh, and what, what difficulty do you play on, Dave? Dave, what difficulty is your wife? Oh, I didn't mean to say wife. <laughs> I meant life. <laughs> I, I, re I didn't say wife. Bertha is the original flat top grill, she is. And we're gonna get them onions and everything to go in right here. But first folks, we need to have a dab of oil on there. But yeah, everyone does have baggage. The thing is, I want as little baggage as possible and that means younger. Disgusting, he's so disgusting. For women. For women. Luckily, no younger woman wants him for any reason whatsoever. 
it's going to help. Could you also do this in like a cast You could do this in a cast iron skillet. <clears throat> How is it a creepy take? Rin, you used to be part of my fucking team. What? My team? And you can tell that things might not be really level here, so... Ooh, I, love <laughs> I, I don't know how it works for gay men. I'm assuming you're attracted to guys. I think he means sexuality. But you were part of my team. Before I transitioned. Team up until five minutes ago, if you like chicks, then yeah, you... You you should be on my fucking side. I'm not on your side. I like adult women. I think they're sexy. I don't think young kids are sexy. Like what? This isn't a hot take. This is just normal adult sexuality. It should scale with your maturity. That sound I do. Let's go ahead now. I seen it done a lot of ways. Okay, you're a lesbian. I love Cowboy Camp Rollins. I said I don't want to date 18 year olds. You're a lesbian. Hmm. I don't know if it's a lesbian. I don't know. Maybe it is. Who used to be a man? Who used to? Be you should be on my fucking side then. We're looking for the same thing. Well, you guys do you, but as for me, I'm looking at 10 to 15. Whoa! Ten to 15. <clears throat> Good luck. Do you want to, do you, okay, so there's two reasons that, well, three reasons that Dave has these opinions. Number one, pedophile. Number two, uh, he has, he has this opinion because he knows it's unattainable, and so he will never have to answer, he can always appeal to his standards are just so high, not he's a piece of shit that no one wants to date. Uh, and number three, uh, what was the other thing I was going to say? Wait, he wants to date 10 to 15 years younger than him. I definitely had a third thing I was going to say about Dave and why this is fucked up. <laughs> but I got distracted because I was like, well, there's a third one. And it was pedophile. Huh. In fact, the, young, the, the youngest I would date would be seriously 18. Oh, that's not so bad. And then he goes, actually, I would go way younger than that. Yeah, I mean, he's just so disgusting. Actually fucking gross. Literally, literally a fucking groomer, dude. <laughs> like, actually a disgusting man. Uh, Don't let the revolution happen, Dave. Yeah. <laughs> Let the revolution happen. I don't think he lasts long on the uh, anarcho-communist. Uh, <laughs> some pe I know some people in Black Block <laughs> that would, would not, not like this. They wear Black Block 100% of the time. Uh, hello, police. Uh, look, I know we don't see eye to eye, but could you do me and society a solid? Jesus Christ. Uh, <laughs> claims 10, 15 year dis difference then lists a 25 year difference. I couldn't. Dude, the the idea of dating an 18-year-old now gives me the ickies. Well, I'm younger than Dave by a handful of years. I don't really drink in public anymore, so it wouldn't be a problem. Don't drink in public anymore? Did you get in trouble, Dave? Why don't you drink in public anymore? That's a weird thing to say. What a weird thing to say. Go. What a strange thing to say. By the way, he said he goes to the bar with all his friends all the time. Just tossing that out there. But he doesn't now, though. I don't drink. I don't drink in public. I go to the bar with my friends all the time. We drink. FBI, open up! <laughs> 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 
Brooke, are you insinuating he's unlikable and has no friends in reality? I can't believe you. 18's legal. Disgusting. I can do what I want. No, you can't. Uh, 18-year-olds won't have you. Let's be real, dude. What 18-year-old wants your ass? No 18-year-old. None. Go. Cool. Just so disgusting. <clears throat> what is legal is moral to Dave. Everything browned up we have. Get them down here to the coolest part of the stove that we got. How is 18 creepy? How isn't 18 creepy? What the fuck, Dave? They're an adult. That's so... You have to draw a line in the sand at some point. No. Do we not? What? Yeah, draw a line in the sand at an adult. A whole adult. Not an 18-year-old that hasn't even fucking experienced any life outside of high school or their parents' house, you fucking creep. Someone with real life experience, which is what you're scared of because you know that women that have life experience have standards that you do not rise to. You're intimidated by women that have had partners because you have never had them. You have limited experience with women, and so it scares you. And for some reason, he's sitting around in his fucking pajama pants, bitching about the world every day, and apparently thinks that at some point an 18-year-old is going to walk into his life. And yeah, I know it's kind of a ridiculous notion that on June 8th, a girl who's 17 and can't be touched... And on June 9th, she's 18, and she can do whatever she pleases with Buddy, whoever she pleases. This is disgusting. This is so fucking gross. I also point out the fact that um, when we reverse the genders, uh huh, and you have a teacher roughly my age, uh -huh. fucking a 14-year-old boy. They're a predator. Nobody... We, Seems to give a shit. We all give a shit. The left all gives a shit. All that's bad. That's rape. That's statutory rape. We don't. We we're not. We're not fans of that thing. <laughs> I went to school for teaching, and they they tell you explicitly like, Go. don't be alone with any student. Like never, ever, ever. It's it's they they they. Push it into your head, man. Uh, like he took to the rounding down to 17 on that disgusting excuse. Yeah, I mean, it's so gross. I mean, he's, he's literally saying he wants to fuck kids right now. Ren, there is no power dynamic. As long as they're free to leave, there is no power dynamic. But again, how many girls right now are counting down to the 18th birthday. What? So they can legally show their pussies on OnlyFans. That is their... They can... Sh it, what the fuck, dude? <sighs> okay. <clears throat> I do not think, personally... That that is a responsible age for someone to be able to be, like, like, sexually exploited by capitalism. <laughs> okay. OnlyFans, however, I mean, if I, if, if, if we are going to have capitalism, we are going to have women pursue financial independence in it, and you fucking people like you are out there, uh... Like, I'm just saying, man, like, it's going to sell, and they can. You searching out, as a man your age, these little kids is gross. People closer to their age can legally express themselves sexually, and that's who it's for, right? I mean, you can also take part in it, but man, when you, when you have a thing for that, 
That's gross. Like, just actually a fucking predator. <sighs> Dude, I remember in high school we stopped being friends with a guy because he was a senior and he was dating a freshman. We were like, okay, dude, that's fucking weird. His name was Tommy. Honest question. Honest question. How many girls right now, tonight, oh, God. are counting down until they can show their pussies on OnlyFans? God, he's loving to think about this. There's there's probably a handful of people that are waiting for this ability to maybe make some money on the internet. Uh, but these are circumstances of, like, capitalism almost always. Like, if they're like, oh my god, I really fucking need an OnlyFans. Like, this is this is likely a, 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 a they're worried about money and they want to make cash. Like, in the commune, so to speak, how lefties want to see this is that we don't want people to have to survive monetarily so they're not forced to. You And you think that OnlyFans is like a Im immoral thing even though you watch porn all the time because it's the only way you have any sexual release at all. Of course, I, we both know this. Um, <laughs> you, you are vilifying them for doing a thing under capitalism which you agree with foundationally their ability to free, like you're literally defending it right now because you want to be a pedophile. But also, they're whores to you or something? You know what I mean? I know, it's two girls that happen to have the same fucking birthday. They can end up chowing down on each other. I'm sure a lot of clicks will be done with that. The fuck, man? Now he's imagining, like, made-up underage kids... Like, he's openly fantasizing on stream about underage kids blooming into adulthood at the stroke of midnight and being able to sell porn, dude. Like, what the fuck, man? Sound that is, Beagle? Hear that? But, um, get, getting back to your point, uh, you know, taking advantage of, of more of uh, economically depressed people... Well, if an 18-year-old is offering oh herself to me for sex... If an 18-year-old is offering herself to me for sex... Wow. What an incredible fucking sentence. Offering herself to me for sex. Go to a fucking therapist day before you hurt somebody if you haven't already. Jesus fucking Christ. And I accept that arrangement... Oh. Is that not sex work and... What do you mean, is it not sex work? Here is proof there is no God. <laughs> and isn't your world male feminist view, isn't sex work a good thing? Sex work is good if the person isn't exploited in the process. But obviously, that's not the case under capitalism. And so while sex work is a valid course of work that we're morally fine with, you can consent, of course. If she would not normally choose to fuck you, then yeah, it becomes less and less good. And sometimes people will stoop to fucking you for like, you know, an exorbitant amount. Shiro says, say something nice. The nice thing, the thing that gives me the most comfort, is that Dave has no access to any of the people that he could possibly hurt. And none of the riz that it takes to, uh, or the confidence, uh, that it takes to, like, go to the fucking, uh, little club and try to hit on the 18 and 19 year old kids. Like, <laughs> He is not the guy that is going to go and press some teenagers. You feel me? So, I mean, it's not. I'm <laughs> it's a, it's, it's, he's, he's fantasizing essentially right now. Just asking. Yeah, just asking. Well, I mean, yeah, you, you have, uh, you have 
channel name so concerned for for um uh-huh. for my um you know am I taking advantage of someone getting fucking drunk dude but if an 18 year old wants to engage in a I guess I would call it sugar daddy relationship with me and she's 18 which is legal is that not sex work? And it according to the work. male feminists, like yeah. you are and channel uh-huh. is. and So the sex worker is valid and you are not. Do you feel me? Do you get what I'm saying? Like, I don't even know how you're not understanding this. Like, in that exchange, you are the Go. person exploiting them for money. And they, under capitalism, are making a survival decision to fuck your gross walrus body. Uh, and then repress the memory of it and forget you. <laughs> and, and, like, not be a return fucking client. You know what I mean? Like, Well, pretty much everyone who defends... Hey, girl, want to come to my place and have a tuna casserole with my mom? Jake is. Wait, what the fuck? He brought me up now? And, well, pretty much everyone who defends fucking actual Jake is... Oh. Is sex work not work? Is that a, not a, a noble profession? Yeah, you can be a shitty customer. I mean, she's providing a service, is she not? Mm-hmm. The best is first. <laughs> sex work is work! Right up until a man asks for the services of a sex worker. No, it doesn't change the condition of that work. I don't... I, what? <laughs> he thought of you uh, adjacent to his sex fantasies? Yeah. Oh, the tail of the laugh! The most tail of the, of the red color is cooked. Like, this is the dumbest thing ever. Sex work is work! Sex work is work! All right, sweetheart. Uh, how much for you to suck my dick? You exploited it, bastard! You're seeking out like a child at the at as she turns eighteen for this in your th- in your fantasy. Like hello, walrus body and weird alcohol haze, no service. Uh, yeah, no, I'm not gonna be your fucking simp. I'm not gonna pay for your fucking OnlyFans. You want five hundred dollars off of me? This will involve activities that require you to get on your hands and knees. No one needs five hundred dollars from Dave. What? It's incredible. These are activities I do for I get for free. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> like all you have to do is be a a good person and and, and interact with people that are like minded, and you'll find you'll find a sexual partner. And like, nope, fucking crazy, dude. <laughs> the ability properly consent. Here's the consent. I'll do this for X. Okay, I'll pay you X. There's the fucking consent. God, he's loud. <laughs> Jesus. And these are the same fucking feminist jackasses. That say, oh, women, you, 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 you misogynistic bastard, Dave. You say women need to be controlled. Well, which is it? What? Either women are free to whore themselves out. Or they need to be controlled so they don't do that. Or... There's a system where no one is forced uh, or uh, encouraged to whore themselves out unless they want to, rather than by a uh, uh, necessity uh, under the circumstances. You know what I'm saying? That's that's actually the the system that, that the left is advocating for. And I and again. 
woman woman is what I I regard as an adult female, a.k.a. a female who has achieved the age of 18. Good (laughs) hope. God, I love these. Oh, my God, I love these dumb fucks. You can't have it both ways. Either women are fully capable of making their own decisions or they need to be controlled by men. I really don't think those are the only two conclusions. Uh, <clears throat> so, in your situation at home, does is your mom still in charge or have you now taken control of the home? Uh, which one of you is the top dog at home? Go for it, male feminists! <laughs> Go. <laughs> uh, yeah, man. That's the end. That's the end of the Daves. Uh, well... I mean, suffice to say, every time we have any interaction where Dave is involved, he shows his ass and everybody is like, wow, that that guy is just fucking disgusting in every way. I don't like that guy at all. Stepdad's in charge at home. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Go. We're watching a cooking video. I want to see the cowboy make a Sammy. No, he never gets through any of the things he watches. Uh... So glad this guy is going to die alone. <laughs> True. Fake laughing is just too cringe. I mean, it's... It's such a cope, man. I don't even know. I, I It's... Go. It's hard to be offended by the guy at this point for me. It's just pathetic. I'm going to have five more years before his heart... Five years? I'd be fucking shocked. That man makes it five years? I mean, I guess, well, I don't know. You can really abuse the human body. It's actually pretty resilient, guys. 